this Sunday on 60 Minutes. Leslie Stahl talks to a man who was inspired to become an architect when he returned home to be with his dying father. The two of them worked together, restoring the family's historic home in Poughkeepsie, and then he helped restore the city. Here's a preview. He said, you're doing all this work in Haiti and Rwanda. When are you going to come back to your hometown and work with us in Poughkeepsie? We need a lot of help. Poughkeepsie, like many once thriving industrial cities, has seen factories close. It's downtown choked off by highways. It's storefronts boarded up. To top it off, it's creek flooded during Hurricane Irene. We had just been in one of the most rural places in the world, and we had seen a hospital change the economy. I said, why can't we do that same thing here in Poughkeepsie? So Mass opened a small office on Main Street and got to work. Yeah. Radiant light coming off of there. Converting the city's old trolley barn into an art space and designing housing. It's helping turn this old building into a food hall. We're going to save this building. And converting this long abandoned factory into a new headquarters for the environmental group Scenic Hudson. If you look up, you can see that this whole opening was once a window. That was, was a window? That was all a window. Oh, my goodness. You can see Leslie's full report this Sunday night at 7 o'clock right here on CBS2.